I'm Ildi, Ildiko Eva Stelo. I was born in Budapest in 1941, July 3rd. And my husband. Hi, Marla Sundheim. He also is his middle name. And. Born. Born in 1939, January 5th. In. Clontarf, Minnesota. I was born in a farmhouse. At home, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And Marlon and I met in England in 1961. Marlon was 20. And I was, I just about turned 19. He came from Luther College, Decor, Iowa, and I came from Switzerland. We spent close to a year working together as volunteers with a whole group of community, a lot of young people from all over. One of the first times we kissed and were more committed to each other was at Apple gathering time. You have a slide of me uh, under the apple trees with Hildegard from Germany. So that's stuck in my mind more. How did you get here from Europe? I came on uh, Queen Mary. That was a wonderful trip. Took only four days from uh, Cherbourg, France, to uh, New York. Then I think took the train uh, from New York through Chicago to St. Paul. It's kind of in a fog because it was everything so new to me and the country seemed so terribly big. The trains were quite busy, weren't they? They were full. Mm -hmm. So they added another train. So Marlon was waiting for me at one train and I wasn't on it. And I came on the next one. And I had this definite urge to hide. I was- Really? Yes. <laughs> I uh, wasn't sure. I probably felt filthy. I just felt like, ooh, let's go into a hole. I have to say that for me, it was always an exciting thing to learn new things. We, uh, we got married in 61. The wedding was very typical for the Midwest, for a small church. It was all at the church. No dance, no alcohol. That would have been different for me in Europe. But I felt that I was already here. It was simpler to stay here and do this. Um, I think Marlon's family paid for the uh, wedding. I bought the material and I made my dress. We only had Marlon's sister for a bridesmaid and the junior bridesmaid, and I made those two dresses. So, you know, we tried very hard. Marla's mother made the cakes. I kept it simple. I think our family is somewhat widespread. Kirsten, she has one son, and um, Andrea and her husband, no children. Kari, who is between Kirsten and Andrea. Erica, two children. And of course, Mati, he had four daughters exactly what he grew up with. There is one, one thing that I feel uh, that they're very loyal to each other, very connected. Uh, the times together are very important to all of us. They're not long, but we pack it full with fun things. A lot to be thankful for. life. Life goes on, there's always new things to deal with. Something will come along and we'll know that this is the right way to do things and we'll get it done together. And probably with the help of our children uh, because they have been wonderful help.